boys and girls welcome back to another weekly video it is so awesome to see you guys it is jv here all right so we are in a new month we are in the month of april and this month is all about easter guys all right and easter is about how jesus died and how he came back to life for you and for me and for our sins all right guys so for today our um, question of the month is who wants to be your friend forever and the answer to that question is Jesus wants to be your friend forever so who wants to be your friend forever Jesus wants to be your friend forever awesome job guys now in today's story we're gonna hear about something really cool all right we're gonna hear about how somebody walks on water isn't that cool? All right. And so, but for today, our activity is going to be moving like animals. All right. And so that means you're going to have to stand up and you're going to have to move with me. Okay. All right. So make sure you have all the room. Stretch your arms. Go side to side. Oh, stretch. All right. So our first animal that we're going to move like is a penguin. So penguins move very, very tightly, just like this. So hold your hands out like this and put your arms to your side and they waddle back and forth. So waddle with me, waddle, waddle. We're penguins waddling. Are you waddling? We can waddle backwards. We can waddle forwards. We can waddle to the side and waddle to the other side. Waddle, waddle. Awesome job. Okay. Another animal that we can move like is a kangaroo. And guess what? Kangaroos jump. So we're going to hold our arms out like this because they hold their arms out like that. And we're going to jump up and down. You ready? Video. to do one more animal okay all right so we are going to move like a snake all right and what do snakes do they slither right so we're gonna hold our hands out like this like we're snakes we're gonna slither we're gonna slither this way and we're gonna slither this way going back and forth back and forth slither this way this way. What is the animal? What does a snake sound like? All right, snakes, we're all done. All right, this was fun. All right, isn't it cool being able to move and act like animals? Awesome job, everybody. So that is it for today, and I will see you guys next week. I hope you enjoy the Bible story that's coming up. All right, bye. No matter what, no matter what, Jesus' love for me will never change. No way.
friends, I'm Poppy. My aunt gave me this fun baby bathtub so I could pretend to give all my toy friends a bath. I found all this fun stuff that goes together with a bath. Like, what's this? A rubber ducky. That's right. Rubber duckies go together with bath time. Do you know what else goes together with bath time? Bubbles! Bubbles are so much fun! Let's all splash and make lots of pretend bubbles. Ready? Splish, splash, splish, splash. Bubbles go together with bath time too. There's another thing that goes together with bath time. A fuzzy towel! Towels go together with bath time. Alrighty, now who needs a bath? Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Poppy! Who? Who? Playing with things that go together, are you? Hey, Ollie! I sure am! All these things go together with my new baby bathtub! Tubs and duckies go together? It's true! But I know a friend who goes together with you! Listen to this story. Just follow me through! Who? Who? Follow me through! Follow me through who? I've got a Bible story for me and you! Uno, dos, tres. Oh, hola, friends! It's so good to see you! My name's Luis. I'm getting a fun game ready for my niece's birthday party. <laughs> it's called Ducks and Water. They just go together, don't they? <laughs> We're going to see how many of these ducks we can get to float in this little pool. <laughs> this reminds me of a story from the Bible. Do you want to help me build it? Great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno! Dos, tres, hammer! Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, that's perfect. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible begins at a beach where... Jesus had been teaching people all day. Jesus told his friends, the disciples, to get in a boat to go across the lake. Jesus said goodbye to the crowd, and he went up to a mountain to pray by himself. While the disciples were in the boat, the wind began to blow. Can you help me be the wind? Put your arms up like this and be the wind. Woo, woo, woo. Ready? One, two, three. Three, go! <laughs> Keep going! <laughs> okay, stop. The wind was rocking the boat back and forth, and the disciples didn't know what to do. Just then, they saw something on the water. Do you see it? Raise your hand if you see it. Oh, it looks like... A person! Jesus' friends were scared. Ooh, can you show me your scared faces? That's exactly how they felt. And they thought, could there really be a person walking on water? Huh. Who do you think it was walking on the water towards them? Hmm. Let's see. All of a sudden, the person said, it's me. Don't be afraid. It was Jesus walking on the water. The disciples were so happy to see Jesus and amazed to see him walking on water because they didn't think anyone could walk on the water. <laughs> well, right away, Peter said, Jesus, if it's you, tell me to walk to you on the water. And Jesus said, come. Peter stepped out of the boat. Guess what? Peter started walking on the water towards Jesus. Only Jesus could help Peter walk on the water. 
But then Peter looked around and he saw the wind and he got scared and he started to sink in the water. <laughs> but Jesus reached out and caught him so he wouldn't sink. <laughs> then they got back in the boat together. <laughs> wow! Jesus was with Peter and Jesus is always with us too. Jesus wants to be our friend forever. Hey there, Ollie, tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story. And it's all true. Jesus was always with Peter. And Jesus is always with you, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, Jesus is always with Peter, and Jesus is always with us. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Bubbles and bath time go together. But the best thing that goes together are my friend Jesus and me. See you guys next time. Bye! I am with you always, Matthew 28, 20. I am with you always, Matthew 28, 20.